Hi everyone, my name is Oleg and I'm from Chatfuel. Today, I will guide you on how to create an AI agent that can effectively address the frequently asked questions raised by your users. To begin, let's navigate to the Flows tab in order to proceed with the setup process. Here, we observe a standard flow where there is no existing content. The initial step is to include a welcoming message and a question from your bot. To achieve this, we can click on Add Content, choose Text plus Buttons, and type out the necessary information. Hey, how can I help you? After that, we need the bot to wait for a question from the user, and for that we click Add Content and select Answers. The first message is ready. What should be our next course of action? We pull down the arrow, go to AI Agents, and select First Line Customer Support Agent. After that, we proceed to click on the Setup option and begin the process of customizing our AI agent. The first step involves inputting a name for the agent, which we decide to be Oleg. We may now select English as the language for his response and proceed. The original text had 80 characters. Next, we just need to add information about his business, for example, working hours, 9 to 5. Next, for example, phone number, just a fake number. Last question, for example, where you are, address, Austin, Texas. You have the ability to include an endless amount of questions for your agent and integrate them into the database for prompt responses. Additionally, you can personalize the connectors related to specific intents by your users. For instance, whenever a user expresses unhappiness, we will promptly connect them to a live chat agent or a manager in order to effectively address their concerns and provide assistance in resolving any difficult situations that may arise. What shall our next course of action be? Configure the connector from live chat. We pull out exactly the same arrow, go to actions and select live chat. Choose an operator to respond afterwards. For instance, assign through these two operators, all questions will be transferred to them when a person is dissatisfied with something. Also, of course, you can add additional connectors, for example, when a person wants to buy something or, for example, make a return and so on. All in all, our bot is nearly complete, so let's proceed with the testing phase. Hey, how can I help you? Hey, what is your address? Now the bot needs to inform us that we are currently located in Austin, Texas. How can I call you? In this case, the bot should answer about our phone number and how it does this. Accordingly, by adding various questions and answers, you can create such a bot in just two or three minutes. Simple, fast, and effective. But that's not all. Now you need this bot to be connected to your WhatsApp number or a Facebook business page or an Instagram business page. What needs to be done for this? How can you do it? We right click, select the entry point section and choose one of the entry points. For our example, I'll just make a chat launched by new users entry point. This entry point is responsible for it being launched every time a new user writes to our WhatsApp business number. Therefore, I extract the arrow from its current position, relocate it to the initial plugin and press the activate entry point. This simple procedure enables our bot to function on WhatsApp and effectively responds to all inquiries. That's all. Now bot can assist you in delegating tasks within a mere three minutes. To stay updated, subscribe to our channel and show us your support by leaving a like. If you require assistance in other areas, feel free to mention it in the comments and we will ensure that our agents are tailored to meet your specific needs. We appreciate all of you and bid farewell for now.